Hi, this is a video on how to use the mixers uh, for the electric students in the guitar class. So, got a couple of parts. I've got the little mixer, the Nady 8 channel mixer. Okay, each channel here. Uh, in most occasions, you're just going to leave it turned all the way to the right. Okay, there's eight inputs on the back, two outputs on the back, and a stereo and mono switch. You're going to want to leave this stereo or mono switch always switched to mono okay now you're gonna have an eight channel snake or sometimes you're gonna have more uh, than one cable but uh, there's eight channels on each end they're color coded it's pretty simple to use um, on the one end it's molded and it's connected pretty solid this is the end that you're gonna plug into the mixer the other end right over here has got more slack those are the ones you're gonna pass um, to the students so that they can each have a cable. Um, the end that plugs into the cable, or, or into the mixer rather, you've got these eight ends. Doesn't matter which ones go what, you just plug them all into these eight inputs. Okay, so they've got all those eight channels in there. Now, row A and row B each has its own individual volume control. Like I said, in most cases, you're just going to keep that all the way to the right, and then you can control everybody's volume, the master volume, from here, which is master volume A. Okay, normally you're going to want that around, pretty much around halfway, maybe a little bit less, a little bit more, depending on whatever you're using for an amp. Okay, got an extra cable right here, single, single cable, plugs right into output A, then the other end of that cable going to go into whatever amp you're using. So if it's a little tiny guitar amp, it's going to go in there. If it's a PA system, whatever it is, it's going to plug right in there. You're good to go. Got an on-off switch. Um, these can actually be powered from a 9-volt battery in the back or uh, an AC adapter, which we should be providing you with soon if you haven't got one already. Turn it on. It's got a little red light to indicate that it's on or not. Turn it off when you're done. That's basically it. Now, if you are going to say you've got seven electric students and you want to use one of these cables for your own guitar, just simply plug into one of the channels and if that's the case, say you're in channel one, I would leave your channel, whichever one you're on, all the way up and turn everybody else's channel down to about halfway, something like that. Oops, this one's a little stuck.